Warren, uh, your first multi-goal game as an Edmonton Oilers. How does that sound? Yeah, it's it's pretty cool. You know, I'm more excited that we got the win there. Um, you know, the boys dug in uh, extremely hard today. You know, I thought we played uh, pretty simple and fast. And, you know, it shows how dangerous we can be when we play in their end. And, you know, just keep building off, doing the right things like that. And, um, like I said, pretty happy that we got that win. You talked about the win, but... You guys' backs are a little bit against the ropes. You guys are icing a shorthanded lineup, 11 forwards, let down the first two goals in this hockey game, but you guys really in control all game. What does this win characterize about this club? I think the the one word that comes to my mind is belief. You know, we stuck together. No one was powered in. Um, you know, we, we dug in as a group, and we knew we could come back, and I think that was one of the keys at the beginning of the year when we were down. We, we believed that we were going to come back, and, you know, obviously on that stretch, you know, it, with so many losses, it's easier to get negative and stuff like that. But, you know, for our group, believing in each other, you could see that on the ice, you know, we keep bringing it into the ozone and keep attacking and uh, foot on the pedal. So it was nice to see that. Despite being the better team for much of the night, uh, your goaltender had to make some pretty key saves, especially halfway through that second period with that glove save on the Seattle uh, power play. How big was that save for you guys? Massive, huge save by Stu. And, you know, he's been a rock all year. You know, there's games... Uh, where we lost and, and we let him down. So, you know, for him to keep playing the way he has, so steady, all our goalies are so great. And, um, you know, that was a massive save. When it came to your second goal of the night, did you immediately know that you had a feeling it was going to be overturned? Or did you have a comment with the ref at all? Or how did that play out? Yeah, maybe a bit. Like, I knew I knew I wasn't in the pain. I knew I got pushed in there. But you never know uh, with some of these decisions. So that's why I was a little uh, hesitant. But, you know, just try to get to the net. and. Um, you know, good things happen when you go to that. Now, on your first goal of the night, it was a great play by Yamamoto on 200 feet down the ice. He made a great play to disrupt the breakaway, and then he gets rewarded with an assist on your goal. Does that play almost encapsulate your guys' effort here tonight? Yeah, for sure. I think it speaks high volume of VMs. You know, you know, he does a lot of things um, away from the puck and on the puck that, you know, he doesn't probably get enough credit for. You know, that's a massive back check. You know, that could have been a goal against, and, and then we don't score, so... Um, he's a fascinatious player. He does a lot of smart things, and uh, you know that was a huge play by him to you know be a huge contributor to our, to the goal there. You guys ended a six-game losing streak on Thursday. How big or how important was it to follow that up with another two-point performance? Yeah, you know we we want to win games. These points are huge, and you know we got to come out and you know try try to keep uh, keep getting the wins, and you know just take it day by day, and you know keep moving forward. Hey, Warren, uh, you, got, you fell down two nothing. But the, you guys had the, 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 the way of the play there. You guys were out shooting them and out chancing them. Does that help you have that belief you can come back like, hey, it's 2 nothing, but you guys were coming? Yeah, you know, I think uh, it's a staying with it. You know, whether whatever the score is, you got to still play the right way. And, um, you know, we were continually attacking. And, um, you know, it's not fun to play against a team who's constantly attacking and playing hard. And uh, eventually, kind of what I said a couple of days ago, you keep pounding that rock, like that rock's going to chip. And, you know, that's what happened today.